Hi guys, um, I wanted to share something with you today about something that I've been doing now for two months. Um, it's called Morning Pages. It's from a book by Julia Cameron called The Artist's Way. Um, and what it is, is you wake up in the morning and as part of your morning ritual, if you want it in there, is to write three pages of streams of consciousness. And that can be anything that comes into your mind. The fact that you don't actually want to write, the fact that you um, are writing, it's cold, whatever you feel in that morning, by the second page you're probably writing about, you sort of delve into the subconscious of what's on your mind and it allows you to get that out onto a page without overthinking. You have that overthinking process and you put it on the page and you have that conversation with yourself. Um, for me, it's allowed me to have a better relationship with myself. It's made it easier for me to make decisions. It's made it easier to find inspiration because I start to become my own motivational speaker when I'm writing um, and I'm telling myself what I'm going to do and how I'm going to do it. And um, then I might get the thought of, oh, what do I want for tea? So I'll write that down as well, um, which is really helpful because it, it stops that nagging voice happening throughout the day of I should do this, I should do that, oh, when am I going to do this? And if you get it out of the way in the morning, um, it sort of starts, things start to manifest in your life. So I've been photographing now, um, like every day for the past two weeks. I know it's taken about a month and a half to get to that level and, and to get a new lens and to do that. But gradually I started making like strides towards doing this so I took my camera to work um, I was working I'm working as a postman at the moment temporarily and uh, I'm able to take my camera out on the road and I can photograph whilst I'm out I can I was photographing people at the depot um, just trying to find creativity and characters and people and stuff that gets me inspired to photograph and I was doing that at work and doing that after work or before work um, because at the moment, because of coronavirus, my industry is. So being able to write and have creativity through writing as well. Um, I started writing more poetry again, which I haven't done for three years. All in all, really, it sort of allowed me to become my best mate because the person who I want to speak to the most at the end of the day or in the morning is myself through my writing, which is incredible because for ages I've just not really enjoyed my own company but now I have something that allows me to have that dialogue um, written on a page um, which is incredible. Um, I'm sure a lot of people get thoughts that spin through their head all day and you don't know how to deal with them, you don't know um, how to like get through them um, and this has been massively beneficial. I mean it doesn't matter what size paper you have. I, initially, I was doing it on an A4 page, um, but then I bought a moleskin because I thought if I'm going to write, I may as well write on something that's like pretty cool um, and nice to write on. Um, my handwriting, it varies. I mean, you don't have to worry about spelling mistakes. Um, the other day, I didn't even write three pages of streams of consciousness. I just um, I wrote three pages of answers to qu uh, a list of questions that I found on Instagram. So you can always find writing inspiration if you just type in hashtag writing inspiration. Um, so yeah, that's been really helpful. I hope that helps anyone who is struggling with racing thoughts, um, unable to have a, a good like relationship with themselves or just have lost inspiration for their creativity or whatever they're doing or is bored because of this lockdown situation. So this has been amazing really recommend it um yeah